What's up guys, Wave Report here, back with another original content video. Now today, I wanted to do something super high quality for you guys since it's been a minute, and I wanted to super deep dive into this new character named General Shao. So I hope you got some popcorn because this is gonna be a very informative video. Without further ado, let's get to it. All of Outworld is grateful for his service. <laughs> You would consign us to endless war. Better that than be Liu Kang's lapdog. The Supreme Commander of Outworld's Army. Now, born into a proud military family, Shao was expected to become a soldier, but he was a sick child who, though brilliantly and eagerly, had an infirm body. Shao's disability infuriated his father, so he dismissed his son's physicians and designed an extreme program to build his son's strength and endurance. Years of toil molded Shao into a physical colossus and forged within him an iron will. As his father has promised, Shao became the perfect soldier. His brilliant tactics and relentless effort won Outworld many victories and him much fame. Though General Shao is sworn to serve the Empress, his loyalty is to Outworld and Outworld only. If Sindel's rule ever endangers Outworld, he will be the first to try and end it in any threat possible. While you may know him as General Khan, others know him worldwide as Shao Khan the Conqueror. He is the former and future Emperor of Outworld and has served as the main big boss villains of the series for decades in many respects. He resembles a large Asian warrior and is well known for his godlike strength, which rivals, if not outright, it seeds that of Raiden and other godly characters. He is also known for his extreme calluseness, brutality, and ferocity in battle, as well as his as fondness for personal execution. Although he has occasionally spared the lives of his subordinates after proving them worthy of their life, he has also spared the lives of other victims, such as Sindel and Kitana, raising the latter like his own daughter and treating the former like his own wife. However, his true power that he served him well and allowed him to rise above the image of the mere warlord is his high intelligence and profound knowledge of the black arts. Like his subordinate Shang Tsung, he has the power to consume and manipulate souls at a much more efficient rate than Shang Tsung. His knowledge of the dark arts has made him a powerful and dangerous combatant along with producing some of Outworld's most deadliest adversaries, such as Aramak and Scarlet. It is revealed in Mortal Kombat Deception that Shao Kahn was an advisor to Outworld as Raiden was to Earthrealm, which would suggest the possibility of him being a god, as well as being the former protector of Outworld during Onaga's rule. He would later defeat Blaze in the ongoing original timeline, ascend to godhood with Blaze's power, kills Raiden, and win Armageddon as the remaining combatant in the original timeline. Perhaps Shao Kahn's greatest strength lies in his ability to work towards his goals with great tenacity and his ability to organize. However, his greatest weakness is his arrogance and overconfidence. Shao Kong has often underestimated mankind and therefore tried to conquer Earthrealm many times with no success. With or without a consort, he also possesses a blind lust for conquest that can sometimes overwhelm his better judgment, allowing him to be manipulated by those that are cunning enough to exploit that weakness. This arrogance and naiveness also allowed for his downfall by his allies on many occasions, such as being betrayed by his allies in the original timeline leading up to Armageddon. 
In the alternative timeline, he was killed by the Elder Gods for his invasion of Earth and violation of the rules of Mortal Kombat allowing for the Netherrealm invasion of Earthrealm being headed by Quan Chi and Shinnok. The former assisted his attempted conquest of Earthrealm as a play to invade Earth and Outworld himself with the forces of the Netherrealm. With both realms being weakened by Shao Kahn's invasion, his past self is later brought to the present in an alternative timeline where he is betrayed by Shang Tsung after the sorcerer became the keeper of time, using Shao Kong and his forces to storm Kronika's keep, only for the sorcerer to attack, defeat, and absorb Shao Kong and Sindel's soul after seizing the hourglass and taking control of it for himself. Though he is a tyrannical ruler of Outworld, Shao Kong, aka General Khan, has made many enemies, but also made allies throughout his entire existence. The sorcerer Shang Tsung is often seen as his subordinate, serving him for over a millennia. Though his knowledge of sorcery and soul magic, he is the creator of the construct Aramak. After believing he adapted daughter Kitana to be inferior, Shang Tsung will create the genetic hybrid Melina for the emperor, who viewed her as his true daughter over Kitana. He later takes in the outworld peasant Scarlet, empowers her with blood magic, and adopting her as his own daughter, as he did Melina. Throughout his tyrannical leadership, Shao Kahn has often allied with other species in outworlds for his conquest, such as the Takata and Shokin. However, as growing civil wars grew within outworld following his first death in the alternative timeline, these alliances would slowly dissolve, most notably during Koto Khan's reign as Emperor of Outworld. After regaining the Outworld throne briefly, these alliances would not last long, with the Shokin refusing to show or side with the Emperor and the Tarkatan finding peace with Koto Khan and Kitana to unite the very divided Outworld. With all of that being said, it brings us to the conclusion of this video that General Shao is a force to be reckoned with. This man is a tyrant beyond tyrants in Outworld. Stay tuned for more content. And remember, if you're watching this video for the first time, make sure you smash that subscribe button and turn on post notifications as this is your brand new favorite and exclusive place for daily Mortal Kombat content. Sound off in the comments below and let me know Who's your favorite out of this trailer? Is it Sindel from the Blair Witch Project? Or is it General Shao, aka the Motaro knockoff? Sound off in the comments and let me know. I will be watching. Catch you in the next one. About to go to Franks. We outside in public, baby. Peace for luck and prince. If they say it's something, we ain't even shaking hands. Pull up where the beef and now they wanna change the plans. Reason why they running, cause we shooting at they mans, yeah. And it's all part of the plan Why she keep on calling Cause she know I'm high demand So in love with me I got her on command She sucked me inside the coop I say and I'm your biggest fan Yo She pull up whenever I land I made it to the top Oh you can see I'm living grand I'm in Cali with some bitches On the beach we bring a sand Keep that 30 on the seat And shoot like curry with the left hand